For over 50 years, 1,500 metric tons of germ gold have been stored in the U.S. Federal Reserve Bank's high-security wing. 26 meters below sea level on the ground of Manhattan is the most secure place in the world to store it, Americans say. But in the past few years, voices have been raised in Germany demanding that the German gold reserves be brought back to German soil, just as the French did in the 70s with their own gold reserves. France let their gold be picked up in New York by warships. The large German gold treasury has an approximate worth of 70 billion US dollars and would be a secure foundation for backing a new currency in the event of a euro collapse. The 1,500 metric tons of gold are a product of German work and German diligence. They come from the post-war era when Germany generated a large surplus in foreign trade during the so-called economic boom. But now the Fed refuses to return Germany's property. After years of tug-of-war, in 2012 the Fed finally consented to handing out at least 300 tons by the year 2020. For 2013, the plan was to return 50 tons of gold to Germany. As a matter of fact, only 37 tons came back, 32 of those tons stemmed from Paris, and merely 5 tons actually came from the Fed. On top of this, the 5 tons were not even bars from the original German treasury. They were newly cast bars with a 2013 impression. German politicians who were sent to check on the German gold reserves returned from New York not having achieved anything. The Fed even refuses to this day to reveal a gold bar register. Leading economic experts across the globe agree the German gold is gone. Germany will never see that gold again, warns ex-Goldman Sachs manager William Kay, and this even though the Fed was never allowed to even touch it, because it was only handed over to them for safekeeping. This is an incomparable act of suppression and provocation and is being actively covered by German politicians. A few weeks ago, it was announced that even the return of the 300 tons of gold by 2020 was to be cancelled. The pressure from the USA was too great, so German politics caved. CDU politician Norbert Barthi told the media, the Americans are taking very good care of our gold. Up to which point does Germany have to randomly bow down to the USA in every situation? When, instead of backstabbing politicians, will men and women stand up who will bravely defend Germany's interests? Are an entire nation's profits from hard work allowed to be thrown to greedy bankers and finance Michaels as fodder? As long as even US politicians such as Congressman Ron Paul categorically doubt whether gold reserves belonging to other countries but which are stored in the US even physically exist, Germany has every right at the very least demand to check up on their own reserves. A sovereign state has to be able to do this, otherwise he's not sovereign. Please share this video to make the germ gold scandal public to the global community. Thank you.